Welcome to the Real Press Start. Petering Out Podcast. Oh, yes. yeah. Put your headphones in and get your Peters out. Back again. Petering Out Podcast. Pop, pop, pop. Pop, pop, pop. Pop, 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 G Weezy, aka G Ice, aka DJ Diamond Nuts, aka the Two Step McGillicuddy, aka Mr. Golf Me Suck a Dick, <laughs> aka um, I don't know, you had someone. It's been so long since we've done an aka roll call. Baby Huey. Baby Huey, yes, that's a good one. Audrey that's a good one. So, did you guys hear? The Vascular Burrito. Oh, yes. Yeah. That's one of my favorites, actually. Can't forget that one. Vascular burrito. <laughs> uh, did you hear the uproar going on about Final Fantasy VII, the remake? What uproar? So Good one of the... Uproar or bad uproar? Uh, well, it's uproar. Is it, is it about Tifa's tits? Yes, it's about Tifa's tits. One of the developers... Are they dying? Tweeted mm, in... Are they sexualizing women again? No, no, it's, no, it's, 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 it's the opposite. It's, it's torn. Some people are like, oh, they're too big. Oh, they're too small. <laughs> They're not big enough. No. No. So why are you wasting time making little titties? <laughs> <laughs> so one of her defining features in Final Fantasy VII was she had ginormous tits. <laughs> and uh, so they 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 shrunk them down a bit. No. So what? The, They're what the, big, but they're in a sports bra. Yeah. So they don't look big. Well, yeah. don't they have different costumes? No. They didn't so have, they they didn't, at that point, they didn't. They, I mean, they might. You never know. They might have, have new costumes in this game. They probably might have costumes. Yeah, they could. That would be cool. But yeah, so the upper, like, it was one of the developers. They're for sure going to have costumes because Cloud has to dress up as a woman. Oh, well, that happened in the first game, too. But so I'm saying, but yeah, so they're for sure going to have costumes because Cloud has to dress up as a woman. You're right. You're right. I can't, that's one of those scenes I look forward to the most in the streaming, just to see how they do it. Like the gym, it's like the gym with all the all the big guys, and they're all just like. Mm-hmm. <laughs> or I guess like a, a drag queen. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what Trump is supposed to be. Uh, yeah. Do you remember that, that scene, Mike? When you had to do the squats. No. You had to beat. You had to beat the gym leader at doing squats to get his his favorite wig. Yeah. And like. Like it's all there are a bunch. Of, it's just it's a gym full of gay dudes. Like there's these giant gay dudes, and like their gym leader is drag queen. Uh-huh. <laughs> and it's just it's such a weird that that whole thing when you have to get her back from because like you go back to oh I forget the name of the what the area of the city is, but you go there and and Aerith has been kidnapped, and she's being held by like this Aerith. I thought it was Tifa. Oh, I'm sorry, Tifa. Yeah, Tifa, and she's a uh, like it's a. Uh, Prostitute, like it's a brothel. Yeah, and like you have to save her from the brothel, but like from like the head, like from the head, the, the guy running the brothel. Uh-huh. And like the the way you, the way you get Tifa back is, well, there's two ways to do it. The first way is if you get the right perfume. They have to get three. They have to get a dress, a, perf- a perfume, and a wig. If you if you beat the gym leader and get the the nice wig, the silk dress, and I forget the perfume you have to get. But like you have to like do mini games, and yeah. you, have, you have to like win each of the mini games to get the highest item. And if you get all three of those, when you go to the brothel, the 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 leader of the brothel he goes, "Oh, I want her," and he picks you instead of instead of the other instead of Aerith or Tifa. Uh-huh. And then you have, you t- you would avoid his advances, and then finally, like they bust in and save you. But like, or he picks one of the other two girls, depending on what you get. Uh-huh. And then you have to go and bust in and save them, and then like it turns into a boss battle. But it's just it's just a weird like. I want to see how they're going to I, 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 like if they're going to change it at all for the new game, because it's one of those things. It kind of doesn't age well. Like it's like why not? Because of the way people are now. Because <laughs> of people, I don't think it's that, that bad. Yeah, I hope they don't like. I don't think they don't change it. Because it's not... Uh, it's more comical than anything. Yeah, that's why it's not... It's not offensive. Yeah, but... It's not know. offensive well, to be like, there's drag queens. Well, it's kind of comical because you're just kind of reading... You're just like reading text. Yeah. And you're just like, oh, this is what's happening. Yeah. But like, when you're actually saying it, people are... You know, people are people, yeah. It's weird how, like, yeah, reading, reading something... 
No, we're like, saying we're we're fine with it. Yeah, I'm not. But yeah. he's saying well, I mean, like I think in the, the social climate we're at today. No, I think in video game context it's fine. You would think. You would think. I think so because you get to choose. If if like you said, you could either dress up as a drag queen. No, either way you end up dressing as a drag queen, but no, it's like, but like the, but depending but, on how good of a drag queen you are, is depending yeah. on how good you are at the mini games. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think it's. I don't think it's. I don't think it's offensive. I don't know. Yeah, but yeah, see, especially back then too. Like back then, you didn't have any of the LGBT. Yeah, but they're plus. not. They're not. But they're not being violent to anybody. Yeah, that, but I think it, deserve it. it could be considered making a mockery. No, they're not though. How are they making a mockery? But it, it, well, if you get the lowest stuff, that's what I want to see too. <laughs> like I want to purposely get the low stuff just to see how bad Cloud looks. <laughs> like, like, I just picture stubble, like you know, yeah, so, that, like a five that, o'clock shadow. <laughs> how is that offensive? It's gonna be offensive to trans people. It's it's not. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if it's offensive to trans people, they're just looking for something to complain about. When aren't people be... looking for and something then, to complain about? And though. then I think... I, that I is think the social whole, climate nowadays. Yeah, but I think this whole social climate is blown out of proportion. It's people are like, arguing over like Tifa's three, tits right now. It's like three people. It's like three people on the internet are mad about something and there's an article about it and then you think <laughs> there's some sort of fucking global outrage about how Sonic looks. I've seen the tweets. When okay. <laughs> I've seen the tweets myself. <laughs> to feel the tweets out there. Where? It's Show a me civil me. war. Twitter. Show me <laughs> on Twitter. Bunch of Russian bots. <laughs> it's a civil it's war. A bunch of Russian bots. <laughs> brother versus brother. Or <laughs> the fake account, anonymous accounts. Like, oh. with, like no, no profile pic, just like it's something stupid as their profile picture. <laughs> it's just the egg. <laughs> it's just the egg. <laughs> I hate when people don't put their picture. Like you're very untrustworthy. <laughs> you don't your picture. Yeah, you're like, <laughs> you're saying, like your own least, picture, or like you're like, like, a like, picture. But, Even yeah. on a pic on oh, Facebook, yeah. If you don't have your own picture on Facebook, then it's like <clears throat> anything yeah, really on awesome. your Twitter or your Instagram. If you don't have your own face on your profile, well, Twitter on my on my Twitter, I have my my little eight bit avatar doing this. Yeah, yeah, that's that's why we don't trust it. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. That's why that's why it is the Peter my Out point. podcast and not the real press star anymore. My, my point exactly. Um <laughs> So you done with the cloud thing, with the Tiva thing? Yeah, I lost my train of thought now. <laughs> um I don't know, to me I mean I mean yeah, I don't think it's it's this outrage culture is it's fake. It's a fake culture. <laughs> it's, a, it's like rape culture. So, <laughs> or is that what they call? Is that what they're called? Right, rape culture. Is that what they call them? Yeah. 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 <laughs> what, was it? what was What was the thing that was You're like, you're attributing to rape culture or something yeah. like that. Yeah. That's yeah. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, yeah. Yeah like, yeah. like our like our like your culture fucking supports rape. There was that one incident recently oh, with uh, that model where she got her cloud got hacked. Oh and yeah! She, so she put it out. She got blackmailed, like. Yeah, and then Whoopi Goldberg was like, "Should I be taking pictures of your shit and sending it to people because everybody gets hacked?" Mm-hmm. And then this bitch starts crying that Whoopi Goldberg's bullying her. <laughs> 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 that she's that she's a uh, victim shaming her. Like no, she's not. She's just telling you to be a little How smarter. It is. <laughs> but the thing about it is, some people like taking pictures of themselves naked. Yeah, but even if they don't send it to me, yeah, some okay, people well, like doing that shit. Care, then don't <laughs> cry. Yeah, then don't cry about it when everybody sees it. Yeah, exactly. Be prepared for that. Like, like, like for me, when weed was illegal yeah. and I was smoking weed illegally, I was prepared for it. And if any time I got pulled over, I was prepared for the consequences. Mm-hmm. You know, I, was, I was ready to deal with it. Like, I may go to jail now. Because, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah like, well, the thing about yeah, espe- especially. Okay, if you're gonna take pictures and leave them on your phone, okay, that's one thing. But if you're gonna take pictures and send them to somebody, that's a whole other thing. Yeah. Because now not only are you trusting that other person to not share your picture that you just sent them, you're also trusting yourself that you sent to the right phone number. You didn't fucking accidentally auto correct, auto type somebody else's phone number. You're trusting T-Mobile or whatever your mm-hmm. provider is. Yep. You're trusting Google. 
you're, you're trusting, and you're, yeah. and you're trusting, trusting that the, the abilities of these hackers aren't mm -hmm. high enough level to get any of that. Which exactly. Proven over and over again that they are. They are yeah. more, than, more, <laughs> more because only because you're like to just get into a I, into fucking the cloud. You just gotta answer a fucking security question mm -hmm. correctly. Yeah, that? and it's kind of easy to get that off of somebody. Yeah. Hey, well, because the security what's question. What's your first like, dog? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, <laughs> what school did you go to? Like, you can look up Wikipedia. Like, what elementary school did you go to? Yeah. Like, you can find that on somebody who looks like a, a celebrity. What was your first yeah, address? Right. Yeah. Like, like that. what street did you grow up? I wonder what. Yeah, you could probably. Or mother's see, maiden name or. They probably even have people's first pets. <laughs> they <laughs> might. Like, Shit. Probably see who Keanu Reeves' first pet is on Wikipedia. <laughs> Keanu Reeves. List of dogs. So it's gonna be like, like four dogs throughout his life. <laughs> no, you're not here, you. She's just guilting me into trying to give her some hot fries. Um. Um. Yeah. I don't. Know. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't think you should take any naked pictures on your phone. Unless you don't give a shit. Yeah. If you don't care that your shit might get leaked eventually. Like, I have a shit ton of naked pictures on my phone of me, but no one wants to hack me. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I've sent I've I've dick pics. Uh, not unsolicited dick pics, but I've sent solicited dick pics. Solicited dick pics. I don't know the name of the episode. That's the name of the episode. So solicited dick pics. <laughs> and that is the name of this episode. <laughs> uh. <laughs> no surprise dick pics here <laughs> that, should be the, that should be the name of the show actually the, 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 whole, the whole podcast no more Peter and Al podcast <laughs> so, so, so dick pics <laughs> nah Peter and Al podcast is too good um, what was I going to say did I ever tell you guys about my buddy Speaking of uh, solicited, or so, uh, speaking of dick pics, solicited or not, <laughs> um, I had a buddy of mine that did a um, an experiment. I, th I forget it was Reddit or it wasn't Facebook. It was either Reddit or it was another like, or it might have been an instant chat. Like, what's that, Omegle or uh, Chat Roulette or one of those? Mm -hmm. He created a female account for a week. Mm -hmm. Pretended to be a female on, her, on the internet for a week. Mm -hmm. And within, like, the first hour, he had, of dicks. he had six dick pics within the first hour. He didn't chat to anyone. He hadn't posted anything. He hadn't done... It was just literally... His inbox was six dudes, dick pics. And it was like, that's the life... I feel like the people who would just, like, automatically send a dick pic, no matter, like, just no context, never to talk to you in a life, that's not their dick. <laughs> Could be. Well, I can say, like I they're say, just sending somebody else. I was going to say dick, yeah. one in one in six. What of is those six? probably are are real dicks? <laughs> <laughs> or are, are there actual dicks? Yeah. But the other five, probably yeah, they're probably just a random dick. Yeah. Saw him, but you know, he he also he play, uh, did a week as a female online, and then like so he chatted with people. Like people would send him messages, and he pretended to be a female, and like. I think out of the like, right, like he'd have be having regular conversations with these people, and like I think he said half the conversations, at some point he would get a dick pic, like just out of nowhere they'd be having a normal conversation. They'd be talking today. Uh, dick, pic. dick pic, yeah. <laughs> like he said, he'd see more dick in a week. Well, that, that, yeah, more. that's how it'd go. How's your day today? What do you think it is? <laughs> well, he says a dick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you think my day's going? <laughs> Very bad based on that picture. You have to live with that thing. <laughs> yeah, but that, that, that was the thing too. Is he said that he saw some of the ugliest dicks in his life. <laughs> like, <laughs> well, no dicks. Are... No, I mean, but yeah, okay. There's not such thing as a pretty dick. But if you're gonna like... if you're gonna send a dick pic, you're gonna send something. You can like get the lighting right. You're gonna take a a, a, a picture where you think it looks good. <laughs> Right? Uh, yeah, but like what Gable's point is, if you're sending a fake one, you're gonna want something that looks raunchy because if it's if it looks too perfect, they're gonna know that it's fake. I disagree. 
I would if I was gonna, if, if I'm gonna send a fake dick pic. No, you don't. No, send no, because, because, send, because, because it's like no, because it's like because you want because I would imagine you want it to be like spontaneous, right? So yeah, I didn't I didn't like take a bunch of time. Just to say your dick pic, you make you make it seem like yeah. Oh, I just, I just, just took a pic. Uh, here's a quick dick pic. <laughs> quick dick pic. <laughs> like I just unzip my pants. There you go. Uh, I don't know. I disagree. Like personally, I, okay, I haven't sent a dick pic, but if I'm going to send a dick pic, I think I would. It, I'd be like a chick taking a selfie. I would take a thousand of them. It's, <laughs> and send it's, the it's, <laughs> look the best. It's not fucking a. It's not a fucking. A scenic view. It's just a dick. You don't need. You don't need a thing. <laughs> you don't need all his angles yeah. and shit. You just gotta take a picture of it. And like, I wouldn't. No, get... no angle's gonna make it look more or less flattering. Uh-huh. I don't. I don't. I. I just. I beg to differ. I, I believe. I think you're thinking too much. I'm, I might be over. No, okay. Now, now, my, now my question is this, though. Okay. So. See, so you're overthinking it too much. I might be. I might be. But okay, because dick, dick, like Gabriel said. Dick pics, are, dick pics are supposed to be spontaneous. They're supposed to be spontaneous. You're not supposed yeah. to think about it. Now, now, what is the logic? If you have time to think about it, you should be thinking, no, I'm not no, going to take a picture. This is true. <laughs> I'm not going to take a picture of my dick and send it to this poor woman. That's why they're spontaneous. Because <laughs> there's no thought behind them. Hey, guys. Uh, really quick. Just want to take a quick break to talk about Anchor. Uh, this is the app we're using to create this podcast right now. Um, if you've ever thought about starting your own podcast... Um, Anchor FM is awesome. Uh, when we were trying to get this podcast off the ground, we had millions of questions. We had nothing, no idea how to do it. How to record an episode? It's, it was a struggle. Um, how do you find background music? We still don't have background music, but Anchor FM lets us do that. Uh, we just don't use it. <laughs> um, how do I get my show posted? How do I get it on Apple, uh, on Apple uh, Podcasts, Spotify, uh, Google Play uh, Music, all the, uh, all the other places people listen? Where do I find advertisers? The answer to every one of these questions is really simple. Anchor. Anchor is a one-stop shop for recording, hosting, distributing, and monetizing your podcasts. And best of all, it's 100% free and 100% ridiculously easy to use. Uh, My favorite thing is that everything is done in the app. You record, you edit, you post, everything's just right there. You know, uh, when I'm not around, G-Roll is able to do it. And how easy is it? It's easy. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> um, so, anchor.fm slash start. Get your own podcast. If you're not doing it, you're wrong. <laughs> and we're back. We we're talking about dick pics. Yeah. So, yeah. my question is this. Okay. Okay, I get it. They're supposed to be spontaneous. Mm-hmm. But what is the point of sending an unsolicited... Like, do you think... What's, what What do you think... Like, okay, you're going to send a dick pic. No, unsolicited or not, it should be spontaneous. Like, it should just be like... No, yeah, no, yeah, no I get that. I get That's that. That's what we're saying. But what I'm saying is, okay, when you send a dick pic... I'll say, just for this example, an unsolicited dick pic to some female that you're talking to. Uh-huh. Are you... Okay, like, I understand, man, we're very visual. If a girl... If we're talking to a girl and she randomly sends us a picture of her tits, I mean, okay, she wants to fuck. Let's... Change this change the context of this conversation now. Uh-huh. Is that what they think chicks are gonna do? Like you send a dick pic, she's like, "Oh, he wants to fuck. Let me go into." I think the, I think they're hoping. I don't know. It's probably well with the, the, the unsolicited thing. It's probably like they're insecure. Mm-hmm. So they're like, "I wonder what she thinks about my dick." So I'm gonna send. <laughs> so so he's gonna feel it out by sending a dick pic, and then the way a lot of reasons. I mean, what it goes through your head when you just say hi to a girl that yeah. fucking is hot as shit, or you know, yeah, I'm like some girl you don't know. You know, you just go up there and talk to her. Same yeah. same thing that goes through your head is, oh, hopefully she sees something in me that like, <laughs> that's hopefully different she... from other guys, yeah. and then we can fucking go out and I could smash. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but basically, you know, yeah. yeah. So I mean, I, I assume it's the same kind of thought process. It's just trying grasping at straws. Mm-hmm. I get. <sighs> And that's just the option. That's just the straw. <laughs> that's, that's the straw that they, they try to throw out. Yeah, yeah that's a half. <laughs> it's just a move they have been trying. It's a move in their playbook that they try. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like the Hail Mary. There's tons of moves <laughs> in the playbook, but 
Yeah. Some of them should just stay in the playbook. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they don't yeah. work. They, they don't, don't have a high, uh, a like, high, uh, Okay, like, if you get asked, for a dick, that's something different. Mm-hmm. Like, if you get asked, like, send me a picture of your penis. Well, I wonder, okay, let's... Maybe we just should, like that. Maybe we should run an experiment. <laughs> <laughs> you right. send as many dick, dick, you send dick pics to as many girls as possible. <laughs> All right, that's what we'll do. We'll just go online. Just like, like, <laughs> Wait, sorry, girls. are we going to send dick pics our, yeah. our, our own person, or are we going to find a dick pic? No, we'll find, we'll find somebody else's dick. We'll find, we'll, okay, yes. so we'll, <laughs> we'll, we can do, we can we'll, do we'll, it. We'll vote. All right, here, uh, fan we'll, submissions. We'll, no, we could do it. <laughs> we could do it three. We could do it three ways, right? So one uses a fake. One uses a fake. One uses their own. Where you do it in your way, where it's all like, fucking the lighting's perfect and blah blah blah. Then one just does it fucking bad. Just one of them. Oh good. Huh. And then we'll come back with the with the results a week later. Yeah. When you say a fake, I always I just imagine like. I got picked up a belt. Like, no, no. like, let's say, like, you, and then you just, like, oh, you should have a black dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> Why is it so dark? Just the lighting. It, 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 <laughs> I was on a tanning bed earlier. It's nighttime like, right now. I like experimenting with different lights. <laughs> Oh god! <laughs> oh my god, that's fucking hilarious! <laughs> oh fuck! Uh, I don't know. It, it, some girls like dick pics. I'm sure there's some that like. Well, so yeah, it. yeah, it's just a matter. Of, I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm sure. Of how many? It's probably it's probably not like not half of them. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know, that's probably like a very low. It's a very yeah, very low percentage of chicks actually <laughs> so, like I dick mean, pics. Or as you like, unsolicited dick pics. Yeah, or they, there's probably a very few that like dick pics in general, and then and then and then very few that like uns, unsolicited. All right. So the moral of the story is, if you're gonna send a dick pic, <laughs> ask. Like, hey, would you mind if I send you a dick pic? Ask for it. Do they really want to see it, or do they just no? Want yeah, you're supposed to. You're they supposed to wait until to, they are like. Yeah, they just want you to do it, right? Mm-hmm. Like it's more of that yeah, act of doing it, right? Yeah. But that, that I don't think it's the. Actual it's thing. not the actual picture. That's think right, right? It's, mm-hmm. it's the act of doing it, isn't yeah. it? And then they just want to see you don't have a weird dick or something. <laughs> they want to see, yeah, it's not, it's not bumpy. They just want to see what they're working with. What they're working with. But I don't think they look at it and be like, oh, that's sexy. Yeah, I don't or think they really. you know, like... I agree. I don't think they they actually, like... Unless it's part of the whole bottom, like, unless you get, like... Yeah, like, if it's, like... I did like, one like this. <laughs> and then it was like, oh, that's so hot. <laughs> It was a full body pick. Yeah. And, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. There's a metal image I did not need. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, um. well, that was when I was in good shape. <laughs> <laughs> um. <clears throat> Damn. I'm going to play right now. Um. Yeah, I think it's more for. But see, unsolic- I, maybe part of it's the thrill of sending an unsolicited dick pic. Like, how is she going to react to my dick pic? Like, yeah, I got. Yeah. It, it's never positive. Well, I think I think it's always the hope that once he sends it, they're just going to be like, "Oh my god, I want to fuck you." Yeah, I think like, that's the best dick I've ever seen. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, I need that dick. <laughs> You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back to this, listen to this episode, and I'm just gonna isolate all the different things that we're saying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that dick! <laughs> I just said I need that dick. I need that dick. And when I just say like, uh, oh, like, oh, that's the nicest dick I've ever seen. Oh, that's, oh, that that dick's so sexy. Oh, that's so sexy. <laughs> oh my god, this is gonna be awesome. <laughs> um, like, right, okay. You never hear about chicks sending unsolicited back. Like, okay, like, I, I keep saying kids, but... they're not going to complain about it. It's not yeah, an issue. Yeah, yeah, it's a non-issue. It's right? like, why isn't that happening more? <laughs> it's a non-issue, that's why. It there, happens, I'm sure it happens. But there's an entire subreddit. It's a, a subreddit called Creepy PMs. There's unsolicited... Chicks send unsolicited shit all the time. Yeah. 
I guess they do, but like not not just to just random dude. They probably do. I'm sure like uh, fucking Jason Momoa gets random tits and shit. You know what? You're probably right. We should ask him. I'm sure he does. I'm a, I'm I'm a, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm sure girl, girls will find like somebody Johnson. on Facebook who they think just looks attractive to them and they'll just send a fucking nude. And then, you know what? And then, like, whatever the guy thinks of that, then he'll fucking play off of that. Yeah, like, yeah. I'm fucking... I've never like, had that problem, so... Right. <laughs> yeah, like, fucking... Jon Snow probably gets... Uh, Jon Snow, yeah, I'm right. Yeah, yeah we're, talking, well, we're talking about, like, celebrity level people, though. Like, yeah, no, I'm, yeah. And they're, and you're, like, models. Now, I'm and thinking about it, but yeah, you're like, probably right. They probably do get... Rock stars. Just, they would just go up to rock stars and be like, sign my tits. That's true. Yeah, so, I mean, what, what happens in... Now you got Instagram. Yeah, Instagram, you can just send a picture of your butthole. Yeah, you're right. On Shab's fucking podcast, I was saying that one of his friends was like, uh, on Instagram, or he was on Instagram. <laughs> he's, all, like, <laughs> he's all, he's all, they were talking about Instagram models. He goes, he goes, look at, he goes, look at this website. And then he goes, name any Instagram model, name one. And he, and he like, named his favorite one. And he goes, look at who she is. And, and then they're like, you could fuck her for like whatever, how much? Holy how much shit! He's like all these. He's like there's. He's just going through. He's like, and I was like, all of them around there. I'm like Jesus, that's fucking funny. Um, there was one. What did just fuck the MP? Someone just showed that. me a site. Um, like you know, a lot of them have. Oh, like look at my nudes on Patreon, or look at my nudes here, look at my nudes there. Yeah. It's like I forget the name of the site now. It's like something thought. I think it's like Thought TV or mm. something thought. But it's like all the fucking. All the, show all of it. <laughs> yeah, but like all this shit, like like oh, this shit wants you to pay this much to get these pictures. Here they are for free. <laughs> yeah. Oh, right. If you just yeah. go on, if you just look up on Reddit their name. They, oh yeah, they, no, they, one part, yeah. They, they just everybody on Reddit just posts all the shit. Oh really? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I gotta check finding it. Where's the shit? You can, you can find down there anything yeah. you want. Only thing is with your phone app, you gotta you gotta like go and turn off the not- into the website page and uh, turn it turn it turn off NSFW. Uh, uh, filter, mm-hmm. right. and then uh, and then you can look at it on your phone. But otherwise, but yeah, Reddit, it's a pain Reddit, in the ass. <laughs> you, can, you can find down there anything on Reddit. Like I'm telling you, okay, they have a creepy PM. Mm-hmm. But the whole subreddit, all it is, is chicks posting screenshots of these messages of like, I, I, I love the ones that are always like, I love your bobbies. You like sex. Mm-hmm. You want fuck. I like your bobby. Money, yeah, money for bobs. <laughs> yeah, money, money for bobs. <laughs> That's why it's way more harsh when it's they don't speak English. When they don't speak English, you're in a fucking yeah. You fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> I, want, I want fuck you. Hey. I, want, I love, I love, fuck you. Hey. Oh, there was one I saw Stop. recently. Um. Lay down. No, lay down. There's a. Lay it's, down. A it's a cosplayer that people are. Playing. Hey. Lay down. No, come here. Come lay down. Here, lay down. Dang dogs. Lay down. Um, it's a cosplayer that people are constantly like just uh, stealing her pictures and using like creating fake accounts with them. Who's? Uh, Kuba Steph is her name. Kuba Steve. Hey. She was right <laughs> <laughs> directly into the microphone that time. Um, All right, come here. I don't think you heard from barking. Hey! Ivy! <laughs> oh, um. What was oh, so people are constantly stealing this chick's image and using creating fake accounts mm-hmm. like on Facebook or whatever. And there was one that it's it's just uh, screenshots of, of. It was like oh uh oh like it was a picture of her that the, the the caption was like oh baby I want to fuck tonight. Oh baby. And it was a bunch of Nigerian dudes. Like, I love you so. No, I think it was like, no, I think the character said, "I love you," or "If you love me, I want to fuck tonight," or something like that. And it was like all. It was a bunch of Nigerian dudes. Like literally, just all Nigerian dudes with names that had multiple syllables. Like, uh-huh. yeah. <laughs> and it was, all of them were, "I love you so much." I love you. And then like, there was one specifically I remember reading that made me laugh. It was like, cause okay, she wasn't. She was okay. She's at the beach. She's wearing a long sleeve shirt. Uh-huh. At the beach, that went to about like they were like a short skirt. She was wearing you know bikini bottoms, right. but so it was all legs. The picture was pretty much, and someone put, "How dare you expose your nakedness to the world? You should pray and beg for forgiveness." 
<laughs> and it was like just pray and beg for forgiveness. Uh, oh, and like and then like, he's like, you should say this prayer. And like he wrote out the prayer and, and like beg for forgiveness for showing off your nakedness. Mm-hmm. I was like, she's showing her legs. Where's, where's was one probably like a like one of the, someone from an Islamic country. One, one, yeah. one of those worst was one of these guys I used to work with close to today. Uh, it was a fucking rainbow. They come to share a rainbow, and he said, "This used to be a symbol that God loves everybody, or something, yeah. not for the sins that, 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 that people are committing." And I was like. God, you're so retarded. Uh, the, the, the other day, he posted one that was like, I said, Jesus is the one God, not Allah. And I was like, Allah just means God. God. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The correct statement would be not Muhammad. Or, or, yeah, or yeah. no, I said, Mas- yeah, Jesus is the one Messiah, not Allah. Although I guess that's true, but I mean, it doesn't make sense. Yeah. That's not the point you're trying to make. Uh, yeah, like, <laughs> that's not what you're trying to say. What you meant is still wrong. Yeah. <laughs> you said it wrong. <laughs> what you meant was still wrong. Um, it's crazy that there's people who, like... People get so offended by other... Like, well, we go back to the... Just, just, everyone's offended by everything nowadays. Everyone but, is offended by the world. But it's crazy how there's still people who are, like, that religious, that... Like that, another religion offends you, or whatever. Yeah, just, just somebody not being the same religion it's still, makes yeah. you their your, the, makes their, your, your enemy. enemy. Like, yeah. yeah, what? Which and which isn't the point of religion at all. Exactly. Yeah. Like, it, like, and that's and and then when and when you really think about it, it's it's uh, if that if that person could have their way, mm-hmm. they would be a horrible dictator. Yeah, you would be what you consider the worst thing. Yeah, exactly. You would be like a Kim Jong Un. Yeah, because you're forcing. Yeah. You would force everybody to be the same. You're only allowed exactly. to worship this yeah. thing. You're only allowed to think this thing. You're not allowed to do this. You're not allowed yeah. to that. Yeah. That's exactly why you can't have uh, religion dictate laws because it mm-hmm. creates a dictatorship because you're forcing everybody to think a certain way. Yeah, like you know? well, if you break if you break down most major religions, there's like okay, they're all the same. They're all the exact same. So, There's like ten percent that that's different. Yeah, it's just just there might be this the way they worship is different, really. Yes. But like so, like just like for example, the Ten Commandments. If you break down the Ten Commandments, like the first three is like okay, uh, um, what is it? I can't remember what the first commandment. It's like there's only one guy. Like, thou shalt not. Oh, no, thou shalt like, not worship false. false yeah, thou, thou shalt not worship false idols. Though. Like there is one. Like there's like I forget. The first three are pretty much love God. Mm-hmm. Everything after that is love each other. Mm-hmm. Don't kill. Don't steal. Don't you know? Honor your father, and mother. Don't covet your neighbor's wife. Don't. It's like everything is like love God, love each other. That's it. That's what the Ten Commandments break down to. Yeah. And you can pretty much break down every religion to love God, love each other. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. But, yeah. <laughs> but you can only love the ones that. Yeah. You can only the love, love the God by the name I call him. <laughs> It's like yeah, like oh, like as a matter of fact too. Uh, uh, I don't get how people who are in who think that way, who think the opposite. How do they don't see the logic? Yeah, it's like, like literally they like, don't see the false logic. I don't get it. How do you not see? Like, don't you? Uh, if you're that devout, don't you read? No, they, they, don't. they, like, read, they you, read what they want to read. But still, read like they, the they stuff still that know, confirms what they want. But they know, like, they know. Like one of the big things that Jesus would always say is, "Do unto others." Mm-hmm. That's like the main. That's one of the main things. Yeah. Do unto others. Do unto others. As, yeah. So, like, you're supposed to put yourself in other people's position. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. And people, but, don't, but well, you're you're a different religion, so you're an enemy. So I don't got to think about what. What but see, those are, it's it's the same argument. It's that, like lazy thinking. They don't yeah. care to think. They don't want to think about what life really is, or they're just trying to. This, do, is, this is my life. This is my life. This is what I have to worry about. Yeah. Nothing else matters. God, God is all the. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, it's just like, just like the people that do anti-vax, anti-vaxxers. It's the same. It's the same concept like what Gabriel was saying about how they only read what they want to see. Here are six thousand studies oh, yeah. saying. Vaccinations do not cause autism. They help prevent these diseases. And there's a hundred that say that say that they're bad. So then they just they, they only read those ones. Even if there is like a one in a million chance that you might get autism <laughs> from this vaccination, mm-hmm. there's way 
the, the, the odds of you dying from that <laughs> disease that you need the vaccination for are higher than you getting autism. Exactly. So uh, you, you should just take Get, the gamble. Take, yeah. <laughs> I, I remember seeing one. It was, again, it was, it was on Reddit. It was like, people uh, would die of that shit all the time. It was like someone posted in the history. Someone posted something. It was like, I'm, like I'm, I'm anti-vax, not because of the because I feel like it'll give kids autism. Because I believe in uh, <laughs> uh, survival of the fittest. <laughs> and if my offspring can't survive these diseases, they don't deserve to live. I was like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> like, what the fuck? Like, like that person had to be like twelve. <laughs> but like, yeah, people. Are, I don't. I, uh, how do we get on? The this? thing is, it would be fine if um, it was just if it was just your kids. You're talking about but, girls getting messages from Nigerian guys. Oh, yeah, and then the prayer, and then, and then we let them, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, because he was like, oh, I'm dating. I'm your nakedness. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, people are crazy, man. Dude, I think we talked about it on the, sto- on the show once. There's a, a, there's a group of cosplayers now. Initially, it was just this one girl that was doing it. And now, it's a group of them that have been doing it. Like, when they receive dick pics or stuff like that, what they'll do is like, okay, so... Gabriel just sent this cosplayer a dick pic, right? Mm-hmm. So she's going to go to, okay, well, I can, now that you sent me your, um, I think I can look at your Facebook profile. Now I'm going to go look at your friends. And I'm going to find your mom. I'm like, look what your son just sent me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. And send screenshots of the conversations. Well, that's just rude. Why do you got family doing Why do you got to bring, bring, <laughs> bring my mama into this? Well, it's like, okay, well, or like, if you, you don't have a girlfriend or his wife. You know, like, find his significant other. Look what your boyfriend just sent me. Look what your husband just sent me. Okay, that's different. And it's like... You, but still, it's like... Don't send it to your mom. Yeah, that's different. No, yeah, don't send it to like, your significant other. But, like... Because now you're just... You're just Okay, yeah, because like he's being good. that guy is being a scumbag if he if he has a wife or a girlfriend. If, if, you're, if you're if you're sending an unsolicited dick pic, you're being right, a scumbag. You're, you're, in you're general. right, yeah, you're a scumbag in general. So if you're like, it's less scummy like, if you're single. Yeah, yeah, you're not really hurting anybody. You're hurting the chick that had to see your dick. She didn't well, want to see it. Not. She didn't have to open the message. I mean, if it says photo. Photo message. Yeah, and I didn't, I didn't, I didn't text you before. <laughs> you know what? What, what do you think it is? What photo good are you point. sending me that I need to see? Good point. Very good point. Uh, yeah, that's true. I'll give you that one. I will give you that one. <laughs> and then even if it, if she did, it's just a dick. It's just, it's just that a big dick. <laughs> that's gonna be the name of the segment. It's just a dick. <laughs> um. God damn. We did, I think we just did a whole episode on dick pics. I don't even know how long we've gone because we've had to stop a couple times. So maybe like 40 minutes. So oh, so, okay. I only got like 10 before I got to go. So. Okay. Um, well, this, I know there was something else I was going to bring up. Um, EA is calling loot boxes surprise Oh, mechanics. surprise. Yes. <laughs> yes. To get around the loot, bo- the loot box fucking law is being passed. It's not working. It's not working, yeah. <laughs> Well, you can't just call it something else and expect it to. Yeah, it's the same. Yeah, it's it's yeah same. they're having. Uh, they were in. They were in their hearing, or whatever, talking and talking to the legislature people, and um, they're like, "Yeah, you know, we don't. Uh, we don't believe we have loot boxes. You know, we have a lot of. I think uh, we have uh, surprise mechanics that players enjoy, and and uh, and, and are quite. They're quite fun and uh, quite ethical." <laughs> and not loot boxes. <laughs> First of all, <laughs> no. Second of all, no. And like, and like the whole time, like the the the, the officials or whatever they are, uh, were just like they they're looking at him like, like dumbfounded. Like, they're like, well, are you serious? Like I didn't kill him. I just stopped him from living. <laughs> 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 Yeah, yeah, I forgot about that shit. Fucking EA, man. Like, I don't... It was an ethical stop living. <laughs> like, that's why, like, I'm so grateful for, like, for, like, CD Projekt Red right now is the only fucking company out there that... But, oh, that's the other thing. Did you hear Sony's, what they announced? Or Sony Entertainment? Sony, you know, Sony, no, Sony has its moments. Sony has with its what? moments. Well, like, certain, like, not, not with loot boxes and stuff, but DLC and, 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 like, things like that. Not with God of War, not with, no. uh... Came out, but no, but Sony's just a publisher. I'm not the developer. Horizon. Yeah. So I'm talking. I'm talking about like yeah, developer. Well, they only had the one DLC though, and then it didn't. Yeah, really... so that was a good DLC. Yeah, no, that yeah, was a good DLC. Yeah, but it didn't. It didn't. Yeah, the, the game was complete without the DLC. Yeah, yeah, no, I'll give you that. Yeah, you're right. You're right. 
But like, okay, so like CD Projekt Red announced with um, with Cyberpunk that it's gonna be doing very similar. It's gonna so it's gonna be the game itself is gonna be more replayable than The Witcher was, and it's gonna come out with three more DLCs, the same length as what they yeah. did for The Witcher. Right. So it's like huge. It's gonna be massive. Like this game is gonna be just like seriously, The Witcher was fucking massive. Yeah. Like this game is gonna be mind blowing because it's gonna be so just. Like, it's going to be nuts. Like, it's going to take over lives because people are just, you know, it, it's, it's going to, I feel like, because, like, 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 The Witcher was as bad as Skyrim when it came out, where people, like, stopped playing. The base game is as big as Skyrim, and then it had, well, you know, I mean, I mean, it had it, another DLC where you go to another fucking country. Yeah. <laughs> <And> then, <laughs> well, no, I mean, I mean, I mean, impact-wise, where, like, you know, when, like, when Skyrim people, when Skyrim came out, people, like, stopped going outside for a while. Like. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> When the new video game comes out, it's like, yeah, my life getting sucks. No. I do want to go outside, but then I just want to. Also play you just want to play, yeah. yeah. And this is gonna be one of those games where it's <laughs> gonna be forever. Like especially like with me, like how long it takes me to finish games lately. Like, yeah. god damn, because you yeah. suck. It's because I don't get to play as often as I want to. Because you suck. And then when I do get to sit down, like lately, cause I still haven't. Okay, I'm trying to finish Days Gone. I'm so close to the end. Every time I sit down to play, I want to play. And so I gotta sit and play a game. Like she can't play Days Gone with me, so I gotta play a game with her. And it's like so. Then like okay, go watch YouTube. No, I wanna play. <laughs> go play with your toys. No, I wanna play. And I don't wanna tell her no. Like I don't wanna you yeah. know. Like, I don't want her. Or when you get your play PlayStation Five week for later, and just play the PlayStation Four. <laughs> yeah. No, because she's gonna wanna play with me. Because she has a PS3 Pro and she has games that she likes to play on it, but she wants to play with um, me. That's the point. Like, which is good. I mean, I love it. I do. I, I love the tech. But like, when there's a game, like, I just, I just want to finish this game. Yeah. Let me just, I just want to finish this game, please. Yeah, Let me just... She's too smart now to just give her a controller. Oh yeah. yeah. No, you, you know what she does, right? I, I tried that. I forgot how long ago I tried that recently, right? Uh-huh. She's daddy. Put your controller down. <laughs> See, I'm not moving. Like, <laughs> I was like, God damn it, it doesn't work. <laughs> but yeah. yeah. Even if I turn it on, like with the light, because you know with the PS4 you can turn it on and she just won't be like it'll be on, but she's not controlling shit. But no, put, stop pushing buttons. Put your controller down. <laughs> See, I'm not moving. <laughs> <laughs> like for a while too, what I would tell her too was like, oh, you're controlling the camera, uh-huh. and so she was okay with that for a while. First it was like, okay, you're playing, and she, no, I'm not moving, I'm not moving. Okay, no, you're controlling the camera. Okay, and then like after I was like, no, I want you to go over. Here. It's not going over there. I want you to go over here. And it's not going. Then she finally figured out, like, okay, put the controller down. <laughs> See, it's not doing anything. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Michael was nine before he figured that part out. <laughs> 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 oh, man. But, yeah. So, you got anything else, Gabriel? No. Chubb? No. All right. I think on that note, we're going to wrap this up. Um, if you uh, Don't forget to follow us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Start. On Twitter's at Real Press Start. Um, I was going to give our email address, but after this episode, I'm not. Maybe next episode. <laughs> We're going to get a lot of answers. <laughs> oh, so this is Nick's thing. Uh, it's like on the us, website. Yeah. It's, on, it's on the Facebook. It's on Twitter. Don't worry about it. <laughs> like us, rate us, and review us on iTunes, oh. Stitcher, Spreaker, SoundCloud. Uh, anywhere you can get podcasts, you can find us. Enter Petering Up Podcast at Tide. Get well, this out. But on that note, game over. No more questions.